DRC sent me a bunch of RC cars to check out and according to online reviews, over 10,000 people said that these cars were the best thing to ever happen to them. Are the reviews accurate? That's exactly what we're gonna find out in this video. Welcome back to the channel. A couple of months ago, Joe and I reviewed a cheap RC car off Amazon, which was great for kids, but it was a lot more toy grade than we're used to. I have a feeling it's going to be very similar to these cars, if not in the same category. We do have four here, but today we're gonna to be focusing on these two, and in a future video, we're gonna take a look at these more expensive two. So if you don't wanna miss that, make sure you go ahead and you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out. First, we have retailing at $79.99, the DRC9300, this is a 1 18th scale four wheel drive ready to run RC truck for kids. It claims to go 40 kilometers straight out of the box. Over here, retailing at $149.99, almost double that of the 9300. This is the D300E. It is also 1 18th scale and it is for kid adults. So I'm assuming that is the kid's parents. This is also four wheel drive ready to run and it claims to go 60 kilometers straight out of the box. And that will be because this one is brushless. In the box comes the instruction manual, which you should read, a LiPo battery and charger, a small carry bag that includes spare parts and screws, spare body clips and screws, a hex tool, a small screwdriver, a small brush, your radios, and of course, your DRC9300 and your DRC300E. Right away, you'll be able to tell that these are fairly cheap looking RC cars. The tires feel like there are no inserts, but they do have a little bit of tread on them. They both have plastic chassis on the bottom. Under the body, you'll see that they're pretty much the same. However, the 9300 runs brushed and the 300E runs brushless. All of the components from the metals to the plastics do feel fairly cheap and they both have independent suspension, which is quite springy. They are both light, so in crashes, there's not gonna be a lot of force unless it does go that claim speed and I'm not so sure about that, but we're gonna have to test it out. They both claim a 40 minute run time and I'm gonna have a link to both of these trucks in the description box down below where you can find out more about specs and a discount code as well. Anyway, that's enough talking. It's time to take these out and see if they're worth that five star rating. Here we are on location at Templeton Park slash skate park with these two little RCs. We're gonna start off with a speed test, trusty medical tape, see how fast it goes. Track dart, it's hard to control. <laughs> Sometimes with these smaller ones, it's probably better that they're not. <laughs> Dot read. So we got 22 Ks per hour. Oh, this one's, this one's a bit faster actually. Whoa. Whoa. And a little bit easier to control. <laughs> read, 25 Ks an hour. So it is a little bit quicker. Look at it. Oh. <laughs> oh. No. oh, 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 oh. You're just not worried about having to pay heaps to repair it. And perfect for kids, like I think. Oh. <laughs> okay. Go. Oh. oh. <gasps> no way. Still not broken. Ta. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Did you see that? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that was a hard hit. <gasps> this thing's actually pretty tough. <laughs> Go for it. Any beginner can do it, I think. I think. <laughs> it's just straight. That was so 
cool. You actually, you did a massive grind. So personally, not something I'd go for. There are a lot better options out there for this price range. We have made a top 10 RC cars of 2021 video where all of the cars come in under 160 and our favorite is actually under $100. So I highly recommend checking that one out. Two things I'll say, these are good for kids, but not so much the kids adults. And the second thing I'll say is they are from Amazon. So for some of you, that does mean fast shipping. But do let me know in the comments down below, do you guys think these are worth the five star rating? Don't forget guys, thumbs if you liked it, subs if you loved it. I'm Amber, I'm an RC Kiwi, and we'll see you guys next time.